Are you sick of wondering where your free time is gone? Do you want to challenge yourself to be productive and make the most of your free time? If so, you're just like me. So I'm going to share with you my eight week challenge coming right up. Hey everybody, it's me Bonner and you are at my YouTube channel where I post a new video every single Monday. So make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. Okay, so if you're anything like me, your weekends consist of this. Sleeping in, binge watching on the Mindy Project on Netflix, and making it rain. Making it rain. All up on ya. Yeah, there's no point to it at all. So with the summer coming, I kind of wanted to hit refresh on my free time. Recently, I watched a video by my friend Erin. I put her link in the section below so you can check out her YouTube channel. But she created a video that was called the Eight Goal Eight Week Challenge. So without any further ado, here are my eight goals in eight weeks. In no particular order. Number one, this is something that I've been wanting to do for so long. And it's a lot easier said than done. I am much more of a night hawk than I am an early riser. Uh, I'm much more of a sleeper inner. My goal for this challenge is to set three days in the week where I go to bed by 10 and then I wake up by six in the morning so that I can actually get up, go for a walk, maybe go skateboarding, uh, make myself breakfast and then get to work early so then I can leave work at a regular hour, like 4.30. Number two, be more active daily. Believe it or not, there was a time when I was always doing something. I was in dance class, I was doing yoga, I was doing personal training, I was leading fitness classes. Come to think of it, I probably actually spent more time in dance class than I did in lectures when I was in university. Sorry, Dad. And it seems strange to say it, but being physically active, although it does tire you out, it actually gives you more energy. So that's why I've included it as the second goal, because I want to find time every single day to do something. I'm not gonna have this svelte, beautiful physique forever, and uh, I wanna keep it as nice and strong and muscular as it is. The third thing on my list, and this one is so hard for me, is to disconnect. I am always connected, no matter what. I never shut off, I'm always, even on my days off, even when I call in sick and I'm in my bed, zing zing, zing zing, zing zing. I was noticing that I actually have a physical reaction every time I hear that zing, it's kind of like, like it, it hurts me a little bit. So I need to just turn off that notification somehow. I think that will help me a lot. Number four, read more for fun. So there's not a lot to say here. For the next eight weeks, I have set myself a goal of reading two books for fun, which is totally doable for me. Doesn't seem like a lot, but I wanna set it so that I can do it. Number five. Okay, so while I'm not addicted to coffee and pop, I do enjoy having a coffee from time to time. It's the time of day when I get to leave the office and be social with my colleagues. I get the skinny on what's going on in people's lives. And for me, that's so important. I love that so much. So I'm gonna limit the number of times I go for coffee to two days a week. This isn't necessarily going to be very easy for me, but as they say, the most important things in life aren't easy. Okay. <clears throat> This one's good because I'm a pretty creative person and I like to do painting, I like to do brush calligraphy. There's tons of different things that I want to be able to do and I need the time to do it. So for my goal number six is to spend one hour every week doing something creative that's non-YouTube related. Number seven, cook more. I'm setting myself the goal of only eating from a restaurant three nights a week. So for my eighth and final goal, I'm gonna tag on something that I created at the beginning of the year, which was to create a YouTube channel and post new videos every single week. You guys have been giving me some really great feedback and I've been trying to make each video better and better. Do you wanna challenge yourself with the eight week, eight goal challenge? Let me know in the comments below if you do decide to join me on the eight week challenge because the more the merrier. Uh, it'd be good to know that there's more than just me and Aaron doing this and I know she'd be super excited to know that more people are following her uh, on this. And thanks again for watching. Have an awesome week and I'll see you next Monday. Bye bye. That you just, you make it rain. My eight week challenge coming right up. I know. Everybody needs their little vices.
what you gonna do?